What's up everyone? Autumn here and today we are talking about how to do the proper upright row. It's a great exercise to work your shoulders. However, if you perform it with bad form, chances are you're going to work everything but your shoulders. So let's talk about it. First and foremost, you need to pick the proper weight. So depending on how strong your shoulders are will depend on how much weight you're going to lift. The other thing you need to think about is how many reps you're going to do and the tempo at which you're going to do it at because that all determines what weight you're going to use. So for me, if I'm doing 15 upright rows, I'm going to use about 10 pounds on each hand. So you're standing feet hip width apart and the weights in front of you. First thing you want to do is draw those weights up to chest level. Now let's talk about it. While we're up here, the next thing you want to think about is your wrist being lower than your elbows. So you kind of are like a puppet up here. So nice and high, drawn up. Like I said, the weights are at chest level. Shoulders are relaxed and your abdominals are in. So again, if I'm doing 15 of these, I'm going to draw up and I'm going to lower down. Now, here's how you determine if you've picked the right weight or not. You should get tired by rep 12 and 13 and by 15, you should definitely be done. However, if by rep 12, 13, and 14, you're starting to kip, which is this, then the weight is too heavy. You never wanna do that. Kipping is just using the rest of your body to help lift the weight. That's not something you wanna do. So it needs to be the appropriate weight that you're tired by the end, but you're not using other areas of your body to lift the weight. There it is, you guys. Those are my seven tips on how to do a proper upright row, working those shoulders. Thank you for joining me. Check back often. I'll see you soon. Bye.